entrepreneurs. There are three types of entrepreneurs we're going to talk about. And these are the three types that I'm going to give you in my story right now. Follow me as I go along. It might take a minute. I might take two or three takes to make it work. I'm not sure, but I'll try to get it right on the first time. Normally I don't, but if I do, that'll be great. There are three types of entrepreneurs. There is a number one, there is a self-made millionaire entrepreneur. They just slid in, met with the accountants, met with the chief operation officers, met with the staff, told them who they was, identified who they were, how they're gonna make their lives comfortable as the new CEO of the organization. All they see is the bottom line, how much money are they making, and they're gonna take it and run with it. Is that good, is that bad? You, you don't wanna decide, I'm not sure. I'm gonna give you some B-rolls with this so that you could see the different type of entrepreneur. The second type of entrepreneur is the one that has the book knowledge. They went to school, they learned the financial statements, they learned the strategic management of a company, they learned how to go in, how to relate with the employees, how to relate with the staff, the higher staff, how to set up the committee meetings, the compliance meetings, and all of the above. But they never touched any of the product. Have they struggled before in their lives? I don't know, but I tell you what, um, they're the ones that come with a lot of books in their hands. They have to go look in the book to see what it is and what Besides they need to your do at this point. Exam. Now, is that a good thing? It can be because you have book knowledge. You have something to go by. That's the main thing. You have something to go by that can give you some idea of what it takes to become an entrepreneur. The scholarly one. But don't come in with no book sense and think that you have all the answers to the ones who have worked from the bottom up. The third entrepreneur is the one that started from the bottom. What's the song say? Started from the bottom, now I'm here. Burns Barbecue. A smokehouse legend. It's like the last show I just presented to you. A legend, a smokehouse. Started from the bottom, all the way up to the top. Mr. Burns had no high school graduate diploma experience. He went to high school, he didn't finish. But he had up here. That's the sense he had. And he took that sense and he made it work. He started with a couple of slabs of ribs, a brisket, and the secret to his barbecue lies in the fuel. Slow brand and oak. Most oak. That's the secret doing the slow. Hey, I'm so apple pliers here. Oh, that's good brisket there, buddy. His ribs are delicious, man. Roy really understands the business. The main thing is I tell my customer to come back and tell me, you know, if it's bad or good. And I'll start looking for ways to change. Right. Well, you know, when you see cars lined up down the street, that's a good tip off, right? So do you see? Because he is a person that made small business owners feel good about themselves. He brought small business owners up to another level. He made people know who the small business owners were. Now, did he ever get the book since? He didn't get the book since, but guess how much sense he had. He had enough sense to go out to get the resources to do what need to have done. He had that networking experience since. That's that entrepreneur you want to be. You want to be the one that has the experience and then that can turn around. Go out and get the resources. If you don't know what to do, get the resources. Look in the book, get the resources. It's all kind of books out there. You can find somebody to do what you need to have done today. That's the life of an entrepreneur. They think about what they're gonna talk about, they do it, they think about the idea, they think about everything, and they execute it, they put it into action.
Well, I've had employee confrontations. I've had employees walking out. I've had to set up payroll. I've had to take out payroll. I've had to fire people.